I spent the afternoon at the NXP Semiconductors Annual Conference at the JW Marriott in downtown Austin. So this chip company is based in the Netherlands, but they have a pretty big Austin presence. They employ about 5,000 people here. So of course they want to use a conference like this to show off a lot of their latest technology. I spent the afternoon touring what they call their tech lab, where they took over an entire floor of the JW Marriott to show off how NXP's chips are actually being used. I saw a futuristic microwave that uses NXP technology to better heat food by targeting where that food is on the plate and then they distribute that energy based on how much energy has already been absorbed. So basically uh, this microwave can tell whether you're heating meat and potatoes and vegetables on the same plate and it'll heat them all differently. There's a remote control lawnmower that looks like a larger version of the Roomba. One of the most popular parts of the tech lab was this 3D printed car. NXP folks told me it took them about 40 hours to print the car and the whole purpose of this is to sort of show off how NXP technology can be used uh, to develop self-driving cars. I learned about a new portable microwave that runs on a battery. The battery lasts for about 30 minutes, but the salesman demonstrating it told me it could probably heat about four or five cups of coffee before it would need to be recharged, and that will retail for $199. I also saw a billiards table that uses NXP technology to show you where your ball will end up based on the position of your cue stick. This is technically augmented reality. And there's also a function of the billiards table where it can suggest uh, where to place your cue to get the best optimal result. This NXP conference was attended by about 2,500 people, and most of them were employees, vendors, and journalists.